Hello and Namaste friends, welcome back. Today in this video, we're gonna create a kaleidoscope effect just like I'm Mandala effect. This kind of video is mostly used as an abstract motion background and also as a music reactor. So we are going to create this in our Premiere Pro. So before we start our video, as always, let's roll our intro. Okay, so here we are in our Premiere Pro. So, so I have already downloaded some videos for the tutorial purpose. So what I have is a car video and a club video and a and idiom music from the YouTube channel Infraction, which is of course no copyright music. So first, my I'm gonna create a new sequence here. So new item of Yanidi Yanidi sequence. So go to the setting and Yanidi 1920 by 1080 the main standard. Sir. So I'm gonna call this V I D E O video. I'm gonna call this video sequence. So click OK. So here we have our video sequence added in our project. And again, I'm gonna create a new sequence. One more sequence. This time I'm gonna create 1920 by Yapani 19 Yapan 1920. And I'm gonna call this, I'm gonna call this mirror sequence. Click OK. And here we have our mirror sequence, mirror sequence added in our project, and, and one more. One last sequence, go here, new item, sequence, go to the setting, 1920 by 1080, and I'm gonna call it, I'm gonna call it main sequence, click OK. And here we have our main sequence also added in our project. So I'm gonna go to the video sequence. So here we have our car video, so car video line, I'm gonna drop it, drop down to our sequence. Draw which looks something like this. So what I'm gonna do here is right click and here is speed and duration. I'm gonna speed it up 300 time. Click OK. So it is much faster now. Now I'm gonna go to mirror sequence. So mirror sequence, now I'm gonna drag this video sequence to our mirror sequence. Keep existing setting. And I'm gonna go to the effect and uh, Yanity M I R O R mirror when I search got some and drag drag and drop the mirror effect in our sequence. And you go to the effect control reality and the mirror effect likely gonna be okay. You can see our uh, anchor point, which I'm gonna drag to the center. I'm gonna type 960, which is exactly in a center. So in a refract, so Yanity reflects an angle. Man. I'm gonna type 90 degree so yeah it's like i'm gonna fill all the entire screen so let's fill the screen up all right again Control c plus Control v copy the mirror effect this time i'm gonna type minus 90. raw how about it's like from the top i'm gonna fill up the screen something like this raw again i'm gonna copy this effect Control c Control v this time this time in the refract reflection angle, I'm gonna type zero. And again, one more time, control C, control V. I'm gonna type in the reflection angle, I'm gonna type 180. And I'm gonna drag this. I'm gonna type 640. 640. Right, again, one last time, control C, control V. In the reflection angle, I'm going to type 360. Again, I'm going to fill the screen something like this. Something like this. So, this is what we have to do in a mirror sequence. So, mirror sequence, I'm going to go to the main sequence. Again, project map. I want to drag this mirror sequence to our main sequence. So mirror sequence line, main sequence, my drag also. Keep existing setting. And again, go to the effect, from mirror effect like and drag and drop. Drag and drop to our sequence. Reality effect control, my lancho. Reality mirror sequence, ma. Click also, right again, anchor point like center, my lancho, which is somewhere like this. Actually, I'm gonna type here 960, which is exactly in the center. So 960, and the yeah, reflection angle, so I'm gonna type 15 and control C, control V 
and reflection angle mode now 30 again control C control V now reflection angle mode now 60 again control C control V reflection angle mode now 120 control C control V reflection angle mode now 180 so this is it so we have five copy of mirror effect so here we can see a black part in our corner so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna scale it up a little bit maybe up to 114 which will cover our black part so maybe 115 so i think our kaleidoscope is ready so let's let's put up music here so i'm gonna I'm gonna draw a background background music here. I'm gonna delete this video. So somewhere like this, maybe. Let's see our kaleidoscope with music. One more thing here in a video sequence, like you can put your own video, any video. So I have this club video in my project. So I'm gonna I'm gonna change this video to club video. So if I go to the main sequence, so here we have our kaleidoscope is totally changing. So this is how we create a kaleidoscope effect, a mandala effect, a abstract background effect, or a music reactive effect, whatever effect. This looks super cool to me. So thank you for watching guys. Please do subscribe if you are not subscribing yet. Peace.